Hello, friends, and welcome to the Architecture Enthusiast. The House Amhorn, designed by Georg Muche and constructed in 1923 in Weimar, Germany, was the first completed architectural project of the Bauhaus movement. Built for the Bauhaus exhibition of that same year, it was intended as a prototype for modern, efficient, and affordable housing. The design reflects the Bauhaus principles of functionalism, simplicity, and the integration of art, design, and technology to meet the practical needs of everyday life. From the outside, the House Am Horn presents a strikingly simple and geometric form. The single-story structure is box-like, with clean, white-painted brick walls and a flat roof, eschewing traditional pitched roofs and decorative facades. Its modest and unadorned design reflects the Bauhaus' focus on minimalism and efficiency, with the house resembling a rational, machine-like space for living. The house is built using brick and wood, relying on traditional construction techniques but applying modern design principles. As you step inside, the house is organized around a large central living room, which serves as the core of the home. The room is spacious and filled with natural light, thanks to large windows strategically placed to maximize sunlight throughout the day. Surrounding the central space are smaller, more private rooms, bedrooms, a kitchen, a bathroom, and storage areas. The house's layout is designed for maximum functionality, with each space proportioned according to its use. The design prioritizes efficiency, aiming to meet the needs of its occupants without wasting space. The kitchen is particularly innovative for its time, showcasing built-in furniture and modern appliances that emphasize functionality. It was conceived as a workshop for the household, reflecting the Bauhaus ideals of practicality and the rational organization of space. The compact kitchen, though small, is highly efficient, featuring ample storage and thoughtful design that makes daily tasks easier. The central heating system, powered by a coal-fired boiler, was another modern feature of the house. Although it didn't use radiant heating, the central heating system distributed warmth to the various rooms, making the house more comfortable and efficient for its time. This feature underscored the Bauhaus commitment to integrating technology into the home in ways that improved the quality of life. The central heating system replaced the need for fireplaces or individual stoves, contributing to the streamlined, modern aesthetic of the home. Despite its forward-thinking design, the House Am Horn received mixed reactions at the time. Some critics found its aesthetic too stark and utilitarian, especially when compared to the more ornate, traditional homes common in Weimar. The flat roof and cubic form were considered unattractive by many who favored pitched roofs and decorative detailing. There were also concerns that the house, though intended as a prototype for affordable mass housing, was too expensive to replicate widely due to the cost of materials and construction techniques. However, for supporters of modernism and the Bauhaus, the House Am Horn was seen as a visionary step forward. It demonstrated how architecture could be designed to serve the practical needs of its inhabitants, focusing on functionality, light, and space. The use of modern technologies like the coal-fired central heating system and built-in furniture reflected the Bauhaus goal of improving everyday life through design. The house also embodied the Bauhaus principle of blending art, technology, and craftsmanship into a unified whole, creating a space that was as practical as it was aesthetically pure. Today, the House Am Horn is recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a key example of early Bauhaus architecture. While it was not widely replicated, its influence on the development of modernist housing is profound. The house's minimalist aesthetic, rational use of space, and integration of modern technologies paved the way for many of the functionalist principles that would come to define 20th century architecture. The House Am Horn remains an important symbol of the Bauhaus movement's revolutionary approach to design and living. <laughs>